Hi guys, so I'm just going on a nice nature walk down this bike path. A little way around, but um, yeah, here's Aria. It's kind of chilly, so she has her PJs on already. And she is enjoying the weather, aren't you? Yeah, look at her. She just loves looking at the trees. Um, oh yeah, I forgot, never got to show you guys my new travel system. Here it is, it matches the car seat. It's pretty nice, it's Eddie Bauer. It's got, um, goes like that, and then, oh, mosquitoes. Two cup holders, and these, and that. Hey guys, sorry, some guy with his dog came walking by. He's giving me a dirty look, so I stopped the video. But yeah, we're just walking. <clears throat> and there's another person up there. But uh, some lady said that <clears throat> the river's really wide and swampy now. So, and you could tell by the trees that there's been beavers there. So they're making a dam and walking the water. Oh, I get the Kids at the park. I don't know if it says P. I think it says P. It says P. P. Rag. P. Rag. Anyways, yeah. And then those bad pictures there. Hey guys, so we're like on the sidewalk walking back towards my house now. Uh, sorry, it's kind of dark here. Just the bushes cause a lot of shadow. But, uh, and it's kind of getting dark when the street lights are on already. But, um, here's Aria. She fell asleep, as you can see. She loves blankie on her face when she falls asleep, so. And she is sucking on her passy really hard, so. She's probably ready for her night night bottle, and then off to bed she will go. So, we'll get back to you guys at my house. Alright, see you. Okay guys, so I know it's pretty bright in here, but um, I just had to wake up Aria a little bit. She was really sucking on her passy really hard and fussing on and off. So instead of putting her back down to bed, I thought it'd be a bit better to um give her a nice warm bottle. And yeah, um, she actually has already, I don't know how because she was so hungry, she was crying. But, um, I put some, um, sorry, my eye, some gripe water for her colic in here because she, um, or for gas, I'm sorry, because she spit up all over herself in the car seat. I have yet to change her. She's still in the same pajamas. Um, she was just wailing way too loudly. Um, she has her blankie by her eye. Um, that's usually a sign she's really sleepy or she's not feeling well. So I don't know what's going on with her. I will keep you guys updated on what's going on with baby Aria. But um yeah. But on another note, um Noah is still for sale. I will show you him. He is in the crib with Cheyenne. He is still for sale. Um so yeah. He's waiting to find a new mama. Um I just been bonding really well with Aria and I just haven't had time for Noah. And Cheyenne is the baby I'll never get rid of just because she's my, you know, my first reborn I ever uh, got. So, and Ari, I just bond so well with her. I just love her to death. So, I mean, I love Noah also. And if no one buys him, I will keep him. But I am looking to sell him. Um, I said around 200 but I definitely could lower my price. I'm thinking around like 150 maybe now. He does come with tons of stuff, though. Um, so yeah, if you guys have PayPal and you're interested, he's very cute, he's well done, very well done reborn. I did pay more than 150 for him, but I'm willing to sell him for 150 Um, but yeah, so, and here's little Miss Aria. Aria and, um, Noah actually came from the same, um, collector. It was a, a woman in her 40s, and she collects, and she has tons of reborns. And, um, when I called her about Noah, which was before Aria, 
She said, oh yeah, you sound really familiar, like your last name and your email address. And I said, oh, okay. And then I went over and I realized, hey, the same lady we had bought my sister's reborns off of. My sister and my cousin's reborn off of, so. She's just chugging away there. But, um, also too, um, then I got Arya and it was the same lady and I was like, oh man, that's hilarious. I keep getting my babies from the same lady, so. Oh yeah, I know I'm around the same price. She always charges like 180 for her babies. Although my sister did pay only $80 for her baby and my cousin's baby. And she does have her reborn up for sale as well. Little Lux. Beautiful blonde baby. He's been rerouted and everything, so she put him up for a little higher than um, $80, of course. She wants to make a profit, so I think he's like 120 or something, so. But yeah. So we'll get back to you guys when she's done. Okay, so we just changed her little bum. Um, I gotta pick her out some uh, a fresh pair of pajamas, but here she is. She's got a little Zoe diaper on, little Pampers. It's really cute. She wears size one. Oh, sorry, Aria. Sorry, but yeah, she's starting to get really fussy. So we're gonna go change her. Um, her onesie didn't seem to get very dirty. It's not actually wet at all. So I might change it, though, still, just to freshen her up, make her feel better. And yeah, we're going to go get a pair of new pair of jammies. So she's all decked out in her jammies. They're a little bit big on her, but it's one of those nights. She just wants to be cozy. Huh? So it just has a little piglet on it. Um, and it says peekaboo, I see you, and it's just really cute, it'll zip up, like, lengthwise, and, like, for her feet, it fits really nice, but then, like, widthwise, she's pretty skinny, so, it's a little bit big on Aria, but, so, um, she was fussing, so I'm gonna try feeding her the rest of her bottle, because she didn't eat it all, um, and we'll see if, uh, that helps her fall asleep. Okay, so she's not asleep yet, but, um, she is very comfortable. I don't know, she just sort of started rolling. So, she always puts her hand there, of course. Let's see if I can take it away. Aria, what you doing, baby girl? She's just really hungry. Okay, so I'm gonna go finish uh, feeding her this. She spit up again, so I just left her onesie, and I swaddled her, and it seems to be working. She is no longer crying, but, um, you know. So I'm just going to rock her for a little bit. Maybe the cool breeze will help her. And it's just her stomach bothering her is all, so. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll sit. So my delightful hair. There we go. I would turn the light off, but then you guys can't see, so. Okay guys, so Arya's officially asleep. She likes to lay on her belly, and you can kind of see her diaper through her onesie. But she loves laying on her belly. I won't lay her, let her lay on her belly too long, because it's, it's very bad for um, her organs. But just to help her fall asleep, she is knocked out. Had to change her scratch mittens. The other ones are falling off her hands. They're a little bit too small for her now. She's growing pretty big. So yeah. 
So good night, everyone. And she's going to lay beside me tonight just, you know, so I can keep an eye on her and make sure she doesn't have a fever later on or anything. And um, we'll see you guys um, tomorrow or another day. Good night.